Hello everyone, welcome to Manari TV. I'm tired. How can you be tired? Eh? Listen to me. That girl must not be allowed to give birth to an even child for my son. Am I me? Mama, isn't it obvious we've lost her? So how can you be sure that we've lost her? Eh? We've not lost her. Come, let's let's go through this way. We'll see her. way to any man's death. You must learn not to quickly admit to your wrong. 
even when you know you're not innocent. They want you dead for no reason. Perhaps he's a child, they're sick. How did you know? And please, who are you? I am Hikani, your namesake. No! You can't be my namesake! Please, who are you? Answer me. Life is a misery. It takes only the babe to live in it. A lot happened in the world you live in. But unfortunately for you, your heart is so fragile to the things that comfort you. You're scaring me the more. Please, who are you? Knowing me is not as important as saving the life of your born child. You want your child saved, don't you? <laughs> yes. <laughs> this is the third child. I'm conceiving for my husband. This one managed to stay this long. Others die along the way. Worry no more. For this shall be. Have you listened to me? I'm your mother. You must do as I say. So let me let's let's be fun. No, no, no. Hey, shut up. Hey, shut up. Hey, shut up. Hey, shut up. You're shouting at me. And I'm Paula. Are you mad? Of course, sir. Eh? Let me make sure that I'm your mother. I carried you in my room for nine months. You must do as I say. But, Mama, don't be one who shut up. Don't say that you want any more words. But, Mama, enough. Enough. They are close to me. I have to go. To where? Anywhere I can find solace. And what makes you feel you can't find solace with me? You're a woman like me. I would have been more secured if you were a man. But I'm sorry. I can't risk being under your protection. I have to go. When a flat theft does not value the fact that an old woman carries it with both hands out of respect, let it try the flimsy hands of a toddler who will fling it away at any slight provocation. I wish you well, my dear friend. When you get to hell, you tell that to the devil. Yes. <laughs> what have you done to deserve this? Did I feel so? The very day you turned my son's mind and soul for me and the sisters. That was the day you did everything. Oh, Mama, where are we wasting time? Let's lose this, this idiot, this witch, once and for all. Especially this miserable child to cause a baby in our womb. You can do to me whatever you want, but please spare my baby's life. The fact that your brother needs me. You see? You see why I call her a witch? She only needs the gender of this bastard in a miserable room. Witch! I can or whatever you call yourself. You must not be allowed to give birth to this evil child for my son. Oh, <laughs> 
So this has been a dream. A dream? You look terrified. It's been a dream. You had a dream? Yes. What dream would that be under this hot sun? I don't know. You can explain it. Okay, calm down. That must be a terrifying one. Let's, let's, let, let's go inside so you can rest, okay? okay. That's my second minute. Hey! What? What? What is this? What is this? You're breathing. You're breathing. Hey! You have to calm down. Everything will be fine. I have to calm down? Please, you have to put yourself together. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? This is the first time I'm losing my child and I have to put myself together. How? I lost my baby the first time, the second time, the third and the fourth time now. I'm married because I want to be telling my children at my young age. Why is all this happening to me? Who am I offended? Eh? Who am I offended? Why can't I have a child of my own? Please calm down. Oh, God's time is the best. God knows. Oh, come on, Don't tell me that. In times like this, it's the only one that can see you through. Oh, my love, I think Moses is right. The dream I had says it all. What was your dream about? Oh, I saw two men. They were chasing me. They tried to take away my baby. They were asking of my baby. And when I refused, they tried to kill me. I woke up as soon as you screamed my name. Okay. Was this not the same kind of dream you had when we lost our third child? Yes, it is. Hey, who is after me? Huh? Who is possibly taking my children? Hey. Like I said earlier, Mr. Akaba. It's high time you and your wife heard God's drug. Because things like this are certainly not ordinary.
Mama, do well now. This your hair is due. Ah, don't be tying your hair. What the time? Mm. If I come back, you help me lose the hair so that Mama will not be available to lose this hair. Mama, why are you running? Hey, Mama, it has happened again. It has happened. Say, Kana, Kana had another miscarriage. What? Another miscarriage. Hey. Good. She has another miscarriage. Yes, Mama. Three miscarriages in less than one year. Is that ordinary? Mama. Mama. It is not. Eh? I think it's high time we did something about this. Eh? For the fact that I warned my brother not to marry this evil girl. No. He wouldn't listen. Rather. He went ahead to marry that evil girl when there are older beautiful girls and well-mannered girls around here, including my friend Sophia. But who am I? Mama Diko, let me let me tell you this here. This with me is just I don't understand. Oh, let me shut up. Okay, let me think. Sorry, my friend. This is happening. She needs us now, Mama. Is happy. Even she wants you, not me. Hey. I about my son. I am really distraught about the recent happenings in your home. I am worried. You are my only son. I cannot mislead you. You have to do away with that man in your house and marry someone else. You look on. Mama. Yes. With all due respect, I love my wife so much, and I can never marry another woman. Really? So would you rather she keeps eating up the children in her womb before beating them? And I have told is that you, what you want? I have told you severally that she is not responsible for her miscarriages. Then who is responsible? Who? I will figure it out myself. What kind of a stubborn brother are you? Eh? I knew you would not listen. Mama, he doesn't listen to anyone. <laughs> Obviously, it's a mistake calling him down here. Uh, Mama, please. I have something to do. I will see you some other time. Excuse me. Uh, go. Brother, bye bye. Go. Go. Lover boy. Mama, what do we do? What are we going to do? You've seen your son. That is a stubborn, a stubborn brother. Ada, my daughter. Mama. When a woman decides to prepare what you see for her husband, the husband will have no choice than to dance his fufu before dipping it into the water soup. Mama, mama! Hey! The battle line has just been drawn. Oh, yes. So we shall see. Yes, so mama. Okay. Ah, I am here. That's my mama. Ah. Mama, thank you. Oh, yeah. We shall see. Hey, yeah, yeah. Ah, come on. Oh, 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 What kept you so long now, eh? You just let me here to, to be walking alone. I, I think it's easy now. I had to fix some things for my father. That's that's why I'm here. I'm sorry. Uh, it's okay. The most important thing now is you are here. So let's start work. You see from here that this is I've worked there, I've worked there. So from here now go is yours. You have to work it all. Start working now. This is too much for me now. No, is it not only me that has been clearing this place? Please get down to work, Joe. Okay. Make sure you finish. So how is Mama? Mama is fine. Uh -huh. You said you wanted to talk to me about something. Oh, yes, it's about my brother. Look, Ada, I really don't want to talk about your brother anymore. I've never been cheated. 
and heartbroken the way he did to me. I mean, he, he left me for that miserable, mystic looking woman. Look, say something else. Just say something else. Exactly why I asked you to join me in this farm so we can talk. Eh? See, there is still an opportunity for you to have my brother if you truly love him. I mean, if you still love him, eh? really? Yes. Of course, I do love him. Very well, there. Come, let me tell you the plan. You're happy now. So, you finish the work. Okay, because of that, I think. Good, yeah, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Mama is building food very soon. Are you okay? You look weird. I'm fine. Is there anything? I'm not to know. It's just that you know you're my sister's best friend. And if anything is troubling you, I should also know about it, you know. It's not like I'm a busybody. Mm -mm. Learn how to mind your business and take your mind off other people's affair. You'll excuse me. Don't come to my house again. Friend, and um, I will always tell you the truth. I cannot believe that this happened again. Look, my friend, you don't need a soothsayer to tell you that someone is behind this before you will believe. Or do you think your wife is evil, like your mother and your sister say? disappointed. Emilike, you're my friend, you're my best friend, you're supposed to support me. Why are you thinking that my wife is evil? Agaba, I, I, I am not accusing her, okay? You see, we've been friends for a very long time and it's only normal that I tell you the truth. Eh? No, I, I'm just feeling for you. you. You have to know that I cannot joke with a matter such as this. I am serious. Something has to be done about this. Um, Enrique, you're my friend, and I can't lie to you. You see, I can. I love her so much with all my heart. I can't do without her. She is the air I breathe. I have told you people that she is not the cause of her predicaments. She is not the cause of her problems. Okay. You can bring anything for me to swear. I can swear to that and tell you and prove to you that I trust this woman I married so much. No, my friend, it's not encouraging you and support me. I'm not saying otherwise. I know. I know I'm supposed to encourage you, but the, the, the truth of the matter is that. Think about it. Look, my friend, there's no way I will deceive you. Okay? You're, you're a young man just like I am. Okay, now, hold on, let me ask you. Since you don't believe she's responsible, would you rather stay like this for the rest of your life without a child? Yes, will you? You know what? Just think about how you met this woman. Think about the circumstances surrounding your marriage with her. Think about where you picked her from.
I come in peace. Um, what will a beautiful girl like you be doing all alone in this thick forest? Please, what is your name and what are you doing here? Since I've been living dead, I know you're here to take my life. But before I die, let it be on record that a young woman like me died for something she knows nothing about. I was born with my eyes like this. Listen, I am not a spirit of death. Okay? You're safe. I just want to know what you're doing here all alone. Who are you? What is your name? Where are you from? My name is Ikanem. The girl condemned to die for something she knows nothing about. Ikanem. A girl condemned to die for what she doesn't know. I don't understand. What do you mean by that? I will only tell you about myself when you tell me who you are. I, I mean no harm, okay? My name is Agaba. I am from the neighboring village. Oshimini, to be precise. Uh, please, enough about me. What is your name, man? What are you doing here? Of what importance will that be to you even? My dear, enough of the logic. Can you just tell me who you are? Please. A lot of tragedy, pain and anguish is associated with this young woman, as you call her from her name, to her very existence, has a lot of painful traits. But no one would like to know, and not even you. Okay, enough. Enough of your explanations. 
Can you please at least sit? Okay. Please. I'm homeless. You said you have a lot of things to say. Please, can you talk to me? I'm all ears. I am a girl from a mutual loner. I am the only child. An orphan. First they said it was my eyes when I was a child. This made a lot of people to hate me for no just cause. My father died when I was much younger. And they accused me of being responsible for his death. Recently, I lost my mother. Everyone thinks I'm responsible. Look at me. A helpless orphan with no voice. I was ostracized for something I did not do. There she is! Yes. There she is! Youth of my village. So why do I owe this visit? We are rich. And I insisted as one. Yes. Yeah, well, I'm sorry, I'm not sure. We can't stay with a witch like you. Yes, it is only a witch. Yes. I'm not a witch. You yeah. are not. Just look at your eyes. Did you see any of us with such eyes? I know you people hate me because of my eyes. But listen, I didn't kill my parents. You did. 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 You did
Hmm. That was how I got here. I didn't kill my parents. How can I kill my own parents? My eyes have been like this from birth. I am no evil. I cannot even hurt a fly. Believe me. Um, it's okay. Come with me. To where? If it is to take me back to them, so they will kill me. I would rather stay here in the forest and die with the evil spirits. Uh, no, nobody is taking you um, to your people for them to kill you. Besides, I am not from your village. I am from Oshimini. We are far from each other. I haven't listened to your story. I, it is crystal clear that you are innocent. And I cannot watch you being hurt by anybody. But I want to take you to somewhere. Let us leave here. Why are you doing this? I will tell you when we get you. Out from here. Okay, here we are. This is where I stay with my mother and my two sisters. Oh, here comes my mother. Greetings, Mama. Hey, greetings to you too. So, my mother and these are my two sisters. Ada, this is my elder sister. And here, yeah, Uchechi, my younger sister. You're welcome, Agaba. Huh? Who is she? Oh, I'm sorry. My bad, my bad. You see? Ekanebia is my newfound friend. Wow. She's beautiful. And I love her eyes. Yeah, she has blue eyes, right? Yes. Ah, is there a problem with that? Uh -uh. What's this going on here? Sophie, oh my God, please, you're about to rest. Come on, she's away from me now, you know. I'm a man. Who's your love? Eh? I can't hear you. Now listen, listen and listen very good. I have told you severally, don't call me your love. I don't love you. I don't love you. You are older than me. Ah, 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 what does he mean by that, eh? And who is that strange looking woman with strange eyes? Oh. Ada, please talk to me. Me? Ah. If you ask me, who will I ask? I don't understand this at all. Uchechi, please tell me what I need to hear. Ask my sister. She's your friend. Are you stupid? Are you stupid? Ada, say something. Eh, hey, hey, hey. Please don't call me. I'm lost. Me too. I'm lost by you. Hold on, hold on. Stop. I can't help. Stop. Listen. Your mother doesn't like me. Don't say that. Okay, she likes you. Listen, she was only acting up because, I mean, it was the first time she's meeting you. Huh? Please, forget about that. You know you have a set of beautiful eyes and unique ones. Stop it. I know. She doesn't like me. Even your sister doesn't like me. I mean, Ada. Hey, Kanem, what is the problem? Huh? Can you just stop? With time, they will learn to like you. Okay, uh, let's stop talking about them at least. Uh, talk about something more important. Like what? Like you. You see, you're beautiful, you're unique, and it's just like a few days I met you, and it's as if I have known you for the longest time in my life. Stop it. 
I am serious. I know you are teasing me just for me to forget my pain and worries. No, <laughs> I am not. I am not teasing you. Why would I tease you? I am stating the facts here. Yes. You are beautiful. Um, that reminds me. Who was that lady? She called you my love. Sophia, that's useless girl. Ah, come on. I don't uh, have anything with that girl. You see, Sophia is just my sister's best friend. My sister has been telling me to marry her, but I don't like her. I don't even love her. I have no feelings for her at all. So uh, forget about her. She's not important to me. It is you I like, and I, I want us to talk about something more interesting. There is nothing interesting about me. I've told you this before. Well, you say there is nothing interesting about you. And I'm here saying that there are more things that are interesting about you. So I want to take you to somewhere and tell you those things. Okay, let's go. So, don't worry, okay? It's not far, it's just there. Are you sure? Yeah, just there. I don't want to run! Let's go! Run! Run! I don't want to run! My wife is not the cause of our money damage. Okay. Um, it's so obvious you two are just so inseparable. Yes. We yeah. are. I mean, you can say that again. Right now, I feel that. Everything is happening to you because you're in this village. Yes. Why don't you explore leaving this village for the city? Perhaps, you know, take off some time and then spend a while in the city. You know? And then um, perhaps all these things that are happening to you will just be a thing of the past. And if you buy into my idea, there's this man of God. He's a very strong man of God in the city. I recommend you to him, you know, he will pray with you and your wife and then everything will just be alright before you know it. Dominique, mm -hmm. for the first time in a long while, you just said something reasonable. Oh, it sounds interesting. I think I will buy into that idea. It's okay, but uh, I think that was a reception. I mean, how can you say that for the first time I'm saying something reasonable? That's not nice, but it's okay. Um, you're my friend, no problem. Thank you very much. Yeah, 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 I'm always talking about you. You're not a friend, sir. You're not a friend, sir. Ah, my wife is here. Oh. You're going to write. Yeah. Okay, okay. Good afternoon. Yes, good afternoon, my friends. Beautiful wife. How are you doing? I'm doing good, I'm fine. I'm fine. Um, Agaba, hmm? since your wife is here and um, I was rushing somewhere before I decided to stop by, let me just go. Maybe later on, we'll get to talk some more with your friends. Let me see you over here. Just stay with your wife and have fun. Alright. Okay. Okay. Alright, I'll see you then. Eh? Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. Hello. 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 Up here with me. No. I will hold up your mind to you. Don't, don't say that. Come on. I love you. You're my wife. You're the air I breathe. I can't do without you. And I can never leave you for anybody. No. I'm not giving up on our love. Uh, my love with you is forever. Okay? Uh, just that. There is something my friend told me, which I, I, I feel is nice. He said that we should leave the shores of this village and to move to the city. 
you know, in search of solution. Not just in search of solution, but he will introduce me to a pastor that will pray for us and, you know, uh, tell us the, the, the cause of our problems, which I think uh, I know is a better idea. So we can leave this building and, know, and then know what is, what is really wrong with us. My love, do you think that will be the solution? I don't think. I know. I want us to leave this village for the city. Please. My love, thank you so much for standing by me all this while. I love you so much. Sylvia, what is it? What is it? Why are you calling me like that? Has it gotten to the point where you walk past me without saying a word to me? Uh huh. Isn't it obvious that there's nothing that can work between the two of us? Nothing, nothing whatsoever. It's not going to work. Sophia, this is what you've always told me. But look at me. What is it about me you hate so much? What? I should look at you. Am I seeing you for the first time? Well, I don't hate you. But I just want you to get this truth. There's nothing that will work between the two of us. Get it in your mind. See, Sophia, I, I really love you. Of all the girls in this village, you are the one that I really love. Huh? Hmm. Um, please, hmm. just, just try and stand. You love me. Are you serious? Well, you can also transfer that love to another person. Because mine is for your best friend, Adapa. Is it hard for you to understand that sometimes you could love somebody and the person is not loving you in return? If you don't mind, excuse me. that your stomach must have been filled up with all my son's children that we've been eating up. Which, Mama, I don't understand what you are saying. I'm, I'm, I'm putting this for you. You are saying another day, man. Mean which? Which that ends up all our children in, in, in spiritual with this little evil eyes. I got stop calling me a witch. I am not to ask what you do. Yes. If I call you a witch, what will you do? Uh -huh. And I don't push you. You're a witch. But that has done eating up your children. Let me want spiritually. With this your evil eyes, I used to deceive my brother. I am insuccable. Mm -hmm. And I don't push me. I don't push you. Don't push me. You will not like what I will do to you. But what will you do to me? No more what is that? Witch! I have called you witch again. Witch! Leave my brother and me. You are a witch. You are worse. Ada. You are calling me a fool. I'm a big witch. Tell me what I do. Ada, let me ask you. Are you not ashamed of yourself? At your age, you're still in your father's house. You're not yet married. The only thing you know how to do is to talk on, on your brother's marriage. What that is the person you are using and to be right? Do what? You don't want to be doing that, okay? Do this! I don't want to be doing that! Stop me! You don't want to be doing that! Mama, you're here! And you just slapped me! Yes! And you said that my daddy! Your lucky is only a slap! It's only a slap! It's only a slap! It's only a slap! It's only a slap! Come here! Come here! Come here! Do it! 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 Thank you. 
Agaba. Agaba. I wonder what you saw in that good for nothing looking girl with mystic eyes that made you choose her over me. And anyway, I don't blame you because I'm sure she hypnotized you. You've been blaming for me lately ever since she came into your picture. Sophia, who are you talking about? Your so called wife, of course. Sophia, so you no longer have respect. Eh? You no longer have respect. You're calling my wife a mystic wife. You don't have abuses on my wife. Eh? Now listen to me. Listen and listen real good. For the last time, Sophia, whatever you call yourself, I do not want to see you in my shop again. Is it a shop? Eh? I don't want to see you. Don't ever come to my shop. Because. I have told you countless times, I do not have anything, I don't have feelings for you. What can't you understand? I can't love you, I can't marry you, you are older than me, you are 36 and 26. Eh? Okay, but okay. when you are filming me around the village, this is was older than you. Where, where you are you? I live here now. You just saw that I broke your head now, man. Where are you following you around? Who's following you? What? Huh? What is this? What is going to be with me now? My mom and his dad are busy beating your wife up as I speak to you. My wife? Yes. Beating my wife? Yes. I don't I don't I don't I don't I don't I you are your mother, your father has been you. Come on. Mama. Oh. Mama. Mama, I am ashamed of you. Ah! Oh, baby, mama, I am ashamed of you. So you're the one in any of this. Don't just mention my name in all of this. Papa Kola Ma. Can you take on? You. Fat food. Huh? Seven look. Horrible. You won't go and get married and leave my wife alone. Eh? You won't go and get married and leave my wife alone. Always coming to my house to pop nose. Eh? In fact, no problem. No problem. I have had it up to here. And what I'm about to say now is not a threat. Because I'm serious. I am tired of all this frustration. Mm. I and my wife is leaving this place. And you people will never see us again what in their entire life. Ah! I swear. Mm. We are leaving this village of the city. Ah! You will never leave this village. See you. I think I'm poor. No! Please, you're going to hell. No, I don't give a damn. I'm not sad. I'm not sad. I'm not sad. People come and say, go and go to hell and die. I don't care. Mama, Sam. Mama, it's because of you. I'm leaving this place. Because it's not the last. I still want to teach this girl lesson. Yes, Mama. Ada? Yes. Now you think me? Yes, Mama. Come, let's finish this fight now. Ada, you said this fight. Why is she wearing the panel? Mama, what are people are doing to this woman is not fair. That's a problem. Don't just come here, Deva. I'm sure you're the one that went and called that your brother. To come and kill us, okay? As as kill you with that thing, okay? Do yes. Mama. Don't worry. You will come back and meet me at home. As she will back home, you want to bring him to come and kill all of us, all of us, okay? I have one thing for you. I want to give. You will come back and meet me at home. I'm going here. Now, Dada, if you let go to hell without the reach of your wife, I don't care. I don't know, man. Who says?
So my brother was serious about what he said. What did he say? He said he was going to elope with his wife. This is so serious. How serious Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is serious. So she has grown wings all of a sudden and slapped you right in front of Mama. Mm -hmm. Yes, so my friend, she did. <laughs> but trust your friend. I gave her the beating of her life that she will never forget in a hurry. Don't you trust me again? Sis, what I did to her, she will never forget it in a And it is not all you. I will still continue to beat her. What is she run out of my brother's house? Trust me now. I know what I mean. She doesn't have home training at all. <laughs> Sister, that is if you ever see her to beat her. How do you mean? Brother Akbaba kept his threats. They have relocated. Please tell me your mouth and go outside, Jerry. Then, um, what did you just say? Greetings, Mama. Uh -huh. Mama, Brother Agaba kept his promise. He and he was? Him and his wife have relocated. Relocated to where? Mama, we are just coming from his house. His door is locked. We went to the shop, the same thing. So we have to ask people around, and they say they saw him this morning traveling with his wife. Ojuma, I want to say, is it true? Yes, ma'am, it's true. They are like, hey! Ah. Hey! It's not possible, I know my brother. Hey! I'm feeling bad with my brother, so I, I, I can't... Let him go, let him talk! No, 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 no. Are you all right? Eh? Mama, calm down now. She loves her, Gabriel. Oh, love. Hmm. So, Agaba was not just blabbing. He actually carried out his threats. Ha! Huh, my son, but why will you, why will you abandon me in this village now? My only son, where has he gone to? Oh God, what do uh, I do? I'm still in love with him. Let you put on your tattoo let me think. Uh-uh. Let me go with you, I love you too. Mama, come down now, we are shouting. Oh, pardon? Have you seen what you've cost? Mama, what did I cost? Are you, why not the one that went to fight the wife? Eh? Mama, why are you saying me? We went to fight the wife. Why not the one that loved me that carried me to that fight? Huh? You see? You've succeeded in making a gaba to, to go away with his wife from this village. Mama, it is we, not me. Why not the one that took me to the house to go and fight? And did I send you? And you followed me. Mama, you, you caused all this. Mama, because I said you caused all this. Mama, you caused all this. Mama, you caused all this. You caused all this. Mama, you caused all this. Mama, you caused all this. This is my way that caused all this. You went to fight that innocent girl, okay? Mama is me! Mama is a fighter! No, your brother has my only son. Mm. So let me tell you. You see this house? Oh, my mom does not want to Who wants to stay here? Yeah. Yeah. No, I don't want to leave you. No, this in this house, I remember. Look at you. Troublemaker. Do you leave this house, oh? This house cannot no longer contain both of us. I will leave. You succeed in chasing your brother with his wife away from me. Mama, no, man. it is you and I that chase your son away. It's not me. Let me. Why are you not putting it on me? Hey, it's not true. I am going to bring hey. a husband that is you. You just be here, causing trouble everywhere. Eating my food. Marry. You will not marry. You push what? Provide my, 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 Look at them. Get of a feather. Provide our house. I send you. Provide our house. I send you. Look at this girl. Man, I leave them. I will kill you with my bare hands. I'm off here. Papa, I will marry. You see, come and beg me to stay in my house. Mama, you chase your son away. You still want to chase me and walk away. I don't want to. I will go. You will not see me again, Mama. Hey, Papa, I will take you home. Which I think you're not going to see me, Jay. Bianca, did you not tell me where he went? No, he just had the trouble. Ha! Yes, sister. You know, what do I do? What are you doing here? 
I said, what are you doing there? Please calm down. Um, Emenike, I've been looking everywhere for you. And your sister told me you are the backyard, so I had to come all the way. First of all, I'm sorry the way I've treated you lately. I, I, I've realized that you're the only man that loves me in this village. But I, I was blinded by Agaba's love. But trust me, I, I'm here to make it up to you. It is not everyone that loves you that you will love back in return. These were your exact words towards me, or have you forgotten? Um, no, oh, I'm sorry. I'm here to make amends. Mm -hmm. I know you're just here because my friend is no longer in this village. He has traveled to the city with his wife. And so you're just here to console yourself, obviously. Oh, no, no, no. Um, please don't think that way. I'm here because I know you're still single. And I've come to accept your proposal. Please make me your wife. Leave my house. Come. the only woman I've ever truly loved. I've never loved anyone like I love you. And um, it's okay, I'm glad you've realized how much I love you. Um, Thank you. You're welcome. Come here. why you're yet to be married at your age. Take away envy from your heart and you shall find a man who will love you genuinely. I don't understand. What are you saying? Why are you please don't kill me? I don't understand. Do not try to deny the fact that you do not know what I'm talking about. You're just a mile away from death if you do not confess. No, 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 I'll confess. I'll confess, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, please don't kill me, please don't kill me. I think your family, especially your mother, needs this apology. Tell them all you have done to your brother's wife and our born children. For that, your ways shall be smooth again. I mean, of course, of course, make me, please, make me. Like I said earlier, your family needs this more. The heavier you do that, the better for you. Oh, oh, I, oh, no, 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 Chichi, please, Mama. She should be inside. Please call Mama for me. Call Mama first. That's why you're sounding like this. Is everything okay? Trust, I said I'm so much in question. Call Mama for me. Mama. Mama, I have a confession to make. Confession? What confession? Ever since um, I got back this way, I've left this village. I've, I've put in myself. Mama. I've been the one responsible for Baba's wife miscarriages. <laughs> miscarriages? What do you mean? Mama, I'm, I'm sorry. I I was jealous of Baba's young marriage. I, I wanted to be the, the first to get married before every other person in this family. But instead, Baba uh, went uh, and got married before me. Um, so I, I became jealous. Um, I went to uh, uh, Abakaja. Uh, 
and he gave me a charm that I, I, I used to, I buried in Agaba's eyes that is causing all those hey. miscarriages yeah. for his life. I knew it. I knew it. Hey. So, sister, it's been you all along. Hey. I should have known this. Ada, you made me hate an innocent girl for nothing. Gee. Hey, Ada. Ada, how could you? How could you do this to your own brother? Hey, God. God. When now do I go to look for my son and his wife? And then why? No, my baby. It's only me, dear mama. Eh? The dear teenager, my dear mama. That's why I'm giving me to a son and a son. I want to be the boss. So you want to be the boss? Ada, so it has been you all this while. I'm sorry. Agaba, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I didn't mean to. I was just jealous. My wife, please, I'm sorry. I wanted to be the first to get married as the youngest. I'm sorry. Listen, please forgive me. The pastor we met in the city told my wife and I that my sister is the cause of our problems. Hey, please forgive so me, sister. Back. Forgive your sister. And I kept asking myself, why? Oh, how would my sister be this callous and mean? Child, even to your own blood. I wonder. You're very wicked. Oh, oh, please please forgive her. I You're very heartless. Yes, my wife, please. I wonder me. how you became my sister. I wonder so how I was able to born, give back to her. Please help me be my husband. I'm sorry. My brother, please forgive me. It's the devil. Forgive her. Pardon her. My wife, so far. please help me forgive beg your husband. Her. Forgive her. Can you go? Forgive her. Forgive me too. To err is human. And to forgive is divine. We are forgiving you. Yeah. Thank you. From the depth of my heart, Amen. I forgive you. Oh, thank you. At least, I am pregnant for my husband again. What? What did you hear that? Oh, real? Yes, ma'am, I'm pregnant. pregnant. Yes, ma'am. Oh. Oh, my God.